It was nice to get the moisture, but yes. we want spring back again, the spring <laughs> sunshine. I think uh, a lot of people are with you on that, and uh, that's what we're going to do. We're also going to talk a little bit about Lake Powell and the runoff forecast this season. The Bureau of Reclamation just put out their latest statement and forecast for what they're expecting, and guess what? It's going to go up anywhere from 20 to 50 feet. Now, that's a 30-degree spread between rising 20 and maybe even rising 30. 50 feet. So why is that? Well, we'll dive into their forecast. The current elevation of the lake is around 3558, 3558 feet elevation. Uh, so it would rise roughly almost just shy of 20 feet on the low end of the forecast. This is worst case scenario. 3575 would be the elevation of the lake by mid-July early to mid-July. Best case scenario, we're going up to 3610. That would be amazing. That would be around a 50-foot rise. Now, the most uh, likely outcome that they're forecasting is right in the middle, 3590 would be the elevation of the lake. That would be a 32-foot rise by the time we hit early July. So the lake is going up, and it's going to be a great summer. Again, those numbers are by early July. We're looking at a 30-foot rise most likely is what they're saying. Okay, West Mountain, we're looking at the uh, Utah Lake area, the south end of the lake. A little Indian paintbrush there, Gordon Hyde, and those flowers are going to be thriving from all the rain we saw yesterday. Over an inch, around an inch and a half for Hooper and Pleasant View way up north. 8,900s, 8,600s for Brigham City and Tooele. Provo's got a third, the same for Logan and even Sandy. So it was a nice drink of water today. We're dry, mostly clear to partly cloudy skies. Then we have a nice little front that moves in for your Wednesday. It's not going to do much, but drop the temperatures just a touch. Here's a look at the forecast for southern Utah. 78 in St. George, 62 in Beaver. To the north, 53 in Montpelier, 50 in Evanston, and even some 60s across the Wasatch Front. More sunshine today, but you will notice those cooler temperatures as you head out the door this morning. St. George, 70s today, and then it's 80s, and we don't look back, going for 90, the first on the season, next Monday. Wasatch Front, we've got 60s, a little more cloud cover tomorrow, thanks to that cool front. And then it's back to warmer weather as we head into the weekend, Tamara. I like the sound of that. Thanks so much, Matt. Yeah, with the weather warming up.